and welcome everyone to England's Northwest. The action soon to get underway here at Old Trafford. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Manchester United facing Brighton and Hove Albion. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Marcus Rashford, number eight, Bruno Fernandes. And number nine, Anthony Martial. Good, Good luck. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Danny De Gea stands between the posts. Luke Shaw starts with Aaron Wan Bisaka in the fullback positions. Casemiro plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the centre of midfield. And the lead striker today is Anthony Martial. And a look at the lineup for Brighton. Well, the shape is the same, but they may play it in a slightly different way. And key to this game will be the fullbacks. Do they tuck in alongside their centre halves or look to support their wingers? I hope it's the latter. Thank you for attending the Theatre of Dreams. Enjoy the match. And the game begins. Martial. March. Alexis McAllister. Well, that ball looks promising. It has to be. What an important piece of defending. Well, not the greatest pass, easily intercepted. Can he make it count? There it is, the opening goal of this match, and what a start they've made. Well, as you'll see, it's not a good pass out from the back. It's on the wrong side of the player he's trying to pass it to. It's intercepted, and it's a good finish. Yes, of course it is, but it's not good defending all round. So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. Martial. Bruno Fernandes. Well, it's great when you can rely on your keeper. And good pressure high up the pitch. Martial! Well, getting in the way, superb save. And a short corner, let's see. Ericsson. And a goal! An end-to-end -end game! And they weren't behind for long! Well, here it is again. And I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post. But I think he should probably do better. He'll be a little bit disappointed with that. Away again here on the back of that leveller. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Pascal Gross. March now. Well, Beck. March. Just couldn't capitalise there.
And they know they need to stop him. He has time to play it over. Gross read it superbly to take back possession. Ericsson. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. Well, as the replay shows us, Fernandez picks out the pass to beat that defensive line. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So back underway, intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Bruno Fernandes, and it goes! Two goals in rapid-fire fashion, and looking very comfortable here. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder, and Fernandes wasn't going to miss that. He knows exactly where to be in the box when the ball's played in. It's an excellent finish. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Joel Feldman. March, a chance to eat into their lead, and there it is, still life left in this game, and they have the momentum now. Well, let's see it again, because the delivery is absolutely perfect. Hard and low, just inviting someone to run onto it. But I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it shouldn't go in at that near post. Goal well, back underway, and a glut of goals here. 3-2. Ericsson. Here's Luke Shaw. Rashford. Can he put it in? Could be. Brilliantly blocked. Well, they fancy a short one. And cuts inside. Martial. It's a perfect challenge. Welbeck. And now with Estupinian. Welbeck. Fluency of movement. Can he take the chance? Well, there it is. Can you believe this? From two down, they now find themselves level. Well, as you can see, what an excellent back heel this is to set up the goal. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. It has taken a Herculean effort for them to get back to level pegging under these trying circumstances. Rashford. And Martial. Very clever read, Casemiro. 
Bruno Fernandes. Martial! Well, he couldn't quite keep it on target. Just wide. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. What a game we've had so far. Goals at both ends, some near misses as well, and some good individual displays. You can't take your eyes off of this. Well back. It did look on for them, but not to be. Bruno Fernandes. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Martial! And the keeper there to deal with it. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? Elects to go short. And a throw in here for United. Rashford on to Bruno Fernandes can they forge ahead they do and you've got to say they're good value for the lead well we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful and the finish is just as good that's an excellent goal Well, how about this? 4-3. Adam Webster. Here's Gross. Did well to win the ball back. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Rashford getting forward. But timely defending when it mattered. Welbeck. Alexis McAllister. Bruno Fernandes has it. Marcus Rashford. Shaw. Martial. And there goes the whistle. That closes the book on the first half here at Old Trafford. Well, one man who acquitted himself very well in the first half was Anthony Martial. What did you think of what you saw from him? Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'd have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. The second half underway, United with the advantage, but no room for complacency. Pascal Gross, and he takes it away. Anthony, able to skip past his man. Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. Promising attack, this. Bruno Fernandes. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. 
It's an opportunity. Just can't get it past them. Rashford! Surely. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Here's a change for Manchester United. Number 17, Fred. But he's gone short with it. Martial. On to Bruno Fernandes. Nicely timed tackle. Pascal Gross. March. This could square the game. And the ball is loose. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes. He scored once already and close to making it a double. Well, every time he gets on the ball, he looks a real danger today. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Keen to take it short here. It's one corner after another. And over comes the corner. And a goal! To increase their advantage, it's a two-goal lead now. Well, here it is again, and you have to say it's the perfect delivery into the danger area. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. we see all that often 5-3 so a half an hour remaining and well, he's going to be disappointed with that pass United coming off the pitch number 29 United might be able to cash in Sancho here's Martial Dallo on to Fred a wonderful intervention Alexis McAllister. Jaden Sancho. Now options are plenty. Can he put it in? Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averted. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Let's see about the delivery. And it goes! The lead just gets bigger. Surely they can't let this slip now. Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Goal for Manchester United. Number 19, Rafael. 20 minutes to go in this one. Did well to win the ball back. Well, there it is. United have had most of the ball. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Yes, yeah, really going so well for them, and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. Bruno Fernandes just narrowly off target.
March. Well back. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Who's going to get on the end of it? Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Gross. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Can someone get on the end of this? Oh, it's a goal! And certainly a deflection off the defender into the back of the net. Well, there it is. Quite clearly, it takes a deflection, and that's enough to beat the keeper. Not much he could do there. Rafael Varan. And there to intervene. Alexis McAllister. Denis Undav. Well, as we approach full time in this one, Stuart, no escaping the conclusion that United are bossing this. Yeah, clearly the better side. Obviously being fantastic up front, but it's their work ethic for me. They're just not happy unless they have the ball. And they're fighting to win it back whenever they do lose it. It's been a really great performance all round. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. What a shocking pass, really. Fred. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Out of play and a Brighton throw-in coming up. And the referee will go back now to the earlier incident. Yellow card it is. Welbeck. Dunk on the ball. Good use of advantage by the referee. And players waiting in the centre. A sloppy pass. Casemiro, Sancho now, Fernandes, Martial, Casemiro, and he read it superbly. Welbeck, now Casemiro, Rashford. On to Fred. It's still alive. And thumped away. And that is the end of the game. It goes down as a United triumph. Their fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals, and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. Well, as you can see, our cameras are not veering very far away from Marcus Rashford. He has every reason to be proud of his own performance. And Stuart, your assessment of it? 
Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.